going on guys um i decided that i'm going to do a playthrough of demon souls i know that's a really good game i haven't really got the chance to play it yet but i decided that i'm going to play it now and you know see see th how things are with it um yeah yeah i started already just to see if i get a feel of the video game um, because I wanted to know, you know, basic, the basic mechanics of the game and whatnot. It's still a very hard game. I died about three times and I gave up on that save. So I'm just going to start over again. And, uh, yeah, I'm just going to name him Best Bean Gaming. No self plug intended. Gender, male, of course, class. I don't really know which class I should start out as. But when I looked on the Demon Souls wiki, it told me that I should probably start out as royalty. Because uh, royalty is level 1, basically. And you um, you can pretty much, you pretty much get more skill points to allocate. But I don't know about that. I don't know about that at all. I think I, think I either want to be a soldier or a knight. Yeah, I really think I want to be, matter of fact, yeah, I think I'm going to be a soldier. I started out my other save as a knight, <coughs> it was no problem, you know, I, I did pretty good. I don't really know if this shield blocks 100% damage or not, and that'll probably be a little problem for me. Um, I'm going to edit his appearance. Make him look, uh, make him look a lot like me, you know. Make him old as shit. Uh, I'm very, very masculine. Very masculine old guy. Uh, this looks nothing like me, by the way. Wish I could make him like purple or something. That'd be that'd be pretty great. But I guess this works. Um, yeah, I think I mean they're gonna make him a soldier or a knight. <sighs> you know what? I'm gonna go with a knight. I get. Yep, I'm gonna go with a knight. All right, let's start this. We got this. We most definitely got this. Time for me to be quiet. King Aland the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valarfax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. That the old king Alant had aroused the old one, the great beast below the nexus from its eternal slumber and that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls also lose their minds. The mad attack the sane, and chaos reigns. Valarfax spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon's soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors were drawn to the accursed land. But none have returned. Bjor of the Twin Fangs. 
Yurt the Silent Chief. Sage Urbane. Skurver the Wanderer. The Sixth Saint Astraea and her knight Garo Vinland. And Sage Frake the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Me. Has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Oh yeah, this is because I, I started playing already, but I think I'm going to do this. I don't see why not. Only thing I don't like about the tutorial is that you have to get your ass beat. You have to die. You have no choice. Brave soul who fears not death. I shall guide you. So that you may lull the old one. To slumber. Okay. I know the basic controls here, so uh, let's get this started. I know that there's like a backstab mechanic and things like that. I don't really know how to do it. What I do know how to do so far is parry. I, I'm good at parry. Well, I'm okay at it. I'm not gonna say I'm good at it. You have no idea how good that feels. That feels so good to just like demolish them like that. Oh yeah, suck up them souls. Also, I know from watching a playthrough of Dark Souls that um, your weight limit and whatnot matters. Like it determines how fast you move and things like that. <coughs> I don't know everything about this game, but I'm hoping to become one of those pro players at it. I know when it first came out, I wanted to play it, but I was like, fuck that. Because I saw how hard it was, I saw people complaining about the difficulty level. But I don't know. Thinking maybe it'll be, it'll be all right. Crescent moon grass. That hurt. First time I fell from there, it didn't didn't hurt. But I see things change. Everything is consistent. Oh, I parried that. I parried that. Oh yeah. yeah. I meant to parry that. That sounded like a parry. That sounded like a parry. But it just didn't work out that way. Okay. 
How did he get in there? Oh wait, never mind. Okay. So moving on. Moving on. Loading screen, loading screen. We all love loading screens. Do 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 do. Strong attack. Trying to parry here. Success. Oh yeah. Also, I ordered Dark Souls 2. I mean, Dark Souls. I'm going to do a playthrough of that when I finish this. No, if I don't like, get mad at this game and like not play it, that's another parry for you. Just for laughs and giggles. Even though no one's laughing or giggling. Oh. This guy. This guy. This guy. This guy. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. You wanna play? You wanna play? Oh wait. Yeah, you want No, I'm not fucking doing it. I was gonna parry your ass, but... It didn't work. Oh man! I could've parried him there. There too. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Fuck out of here. Moving on, oh shit. Hold up, I'm out of stamina. Oh, holding your shield. Okay. I'll explain that in a second. I'm gonna parry him. I'm gonna parry him. I'm telling you right now. I'm going to parry you. You like that? Because I like that. Alright, so if you hold your shield up, your stamina recharges slower. I just figured that out now. I'm sure tons of people already know that. But I didn't, because this is pretty much my first time playing the game. I think I'm gonna play up to <coughs> the first boss, the boss that you have to die at. Then I'm gonna stop this recording and I'm gonna start another one. Because with the PBR that I use, I'm not really sure how to just like, you know, keep the recording going. I'm sure I'll figure it out at some point, but I, I don't know how to do that right now. Why did I try to play that? How do you jump? is what I need to know. I don't know how to jump. I don't even know if you can jump in this. I know you can jump in Dark Souls. But I don't know if you can jump in this. That works. There's nothing even over here. Let's go. That wasn't a backstab. Alright, so this is the boss that you have to die at. So I'm not even going to try to beat him. I'm just going to let him kill me.
Loading screens. Fun. So much fun. I'm not going to complain about the loading screens. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. I was not there a second ago. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Boletaria. Thou canst not exit the Nexus, but each of the five archstones will connect it. Returns to the Nexus. Okay, I need to figure out one thing here. I know that there's a way to level up. <coughs> I know that it's different from Dark Souls, but I really have no idea how it is done. I know that there's somebody I need to talk to here. Before I talk to Mr. Glowy Bluey guy, I'm gonna find this person that I know I need to talk to, and I'm gonna figure out how to level up. So I'm going to stop this recording and I will be back as soon as I find her.